What's going on guys? Welcome to the garage. Just another Sunday and I'm uh, going to be bringing you guys a video today talking about helmet lighting. Um, when the first oxygen helmets came out, we were really impressed with them. We loved the, the rear light. We still do like them. But uh, recently we've been riding with uh, Craig Nicholson's crew from the Intrepid Snowmobiler and uh, they introduced us to a really cool product from Bite Harder. And um, in just kind of experiencing what those helmet lights are like at night and just through snow dust, thought it'd be cool to do a video and show you guys just how easy it is to add helmet lighting to basically any helmet if you're not running an oxygen today. So um, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys this uh, Bite Harder helmet light. We're gonna do a full install on my Titan helmet and show you guys exactly what's required to do the install show you some comparisons, right, in terms of how bright it is uh, when you stack it up next to the oxygen helmet, and I think you guys are gonna be pretty impressed as we were. So let's get into it. All right, guys, let's take a look at the Bite Harder Helmet Safety Light. This is what you get uh, in the packaging when you order these, uh, these awesome helmet safety lights. Gonna do just a quick unpackaging here, and we'll, uh, we'll take a look and see what we actually get. As part of the kit and show you guys how to do uh, how to do the install sweet really nice uh, installation instructions that you get with it so this kind of maps out everything you're going to need in terms of all the different uh, components for the kit the kits really simple this is the main uh, piece that you get which basically is super bright um, a double sort of row of LED lights that you get uh, with a sticky adhesive piece on the back. And um, you're basically gonna end up connecting this into your uh, visor or your electric um, visor setup. So in the case with the Titan, those are electric goggles. It's already sort of pre-wired on the side of the helmet for my electrical um, connection back to the sled. So the way that this works is you're gonna basically end up splitting that connection. So the connection will go to uh, the back of the helmet light and then obviously uh, to the heated goggles uh, themselves for my helmet. So I'm gonna um, show you guys exactly how this is done. There's a couple of other small pieces just for uh, some 3M sticky tape. And then also for the wiring, you're gonna get some of these little um, clips which just kind of help you neatly tuck everything away to make it a, a really uh, clean install and then the final piece you're going to get some alcohol pads obviously which we're going to use to uh, clean as we prep for the installation all right let's get into it okay guys so for most of you that are going to be installing the uh, bite harder helmet safety light the suggestion and, and recommendation by them is to be installing it on the left side of your helmet, okay? In the case of, of the Titan, your goggle output for the RCA plug is actually on the right side of the helmet. So we're gonna orient the install a little bit differently today just because it is going on my Titan. But I'm gonna show you just a quick picture and we'll include some more information as well. But if you look at the install for uh, most helmets, you're gonna be uh, installing this basically on the left side of the helmet. Okay guys, so I'm just gonna show you really quickly. The first step in this process is really just to set up the wiring, get all your connections made, and then just orient it just by holding it on the helmet to see exactly where you want things to be located. And again, because we're installing this on the right side of the helmet for the Titan, just to be able to use with the electric goggles, this is kind of how I'm thinking I want to have the, um, the install done. So I'm gonna have the splitter. It's gonna be just underneath of where you're gonna clip on your goggles here. And then same thing, now your, your light itself, it's, it's actually upside down, but again, it's because we're installing it on the other side. I'm gonna stretch right across the back there. And then this is your other piece that comes off of the bite harder uh, safety light and it's going to plug right in there so that you've got that all set up for your heated goggles. So it's pretty easy but the first step you definitely want to do is is just kind of orient things to make sure that it's it's laid out exactly how you want it and I'm actually going to give it a little bit more 
wiring here just so that there isn't any stress on this area here. And I wanna make sure that both of these wires are not getting pulled in either direction. So I'm gonna have that probably sitting just like that is about perfect. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna clean up all the areas. I'm gonna remove the, um, the adhesive back, the 3M adhesive, and uh, basically get this ready to go to, uh, to install on the helmet. All right, so you can just see I installed basically one of the, the uh, wiring clips that the kit comes with. It actually comes with two. I just wanted to take a little bit of the pressure off of the light itself, so I've put that down um, right there. Everything else, just again, because of the way that I've oriented this for the opposite side of the helmet for these Titans with the electric goggles, everything looks good. There's no stress on either of these areas of, of where it goes into the RCA splitter. Everything looks good. I'm happy with it. The one other thing you will notice, it's a little cold in here today, so I applied a little bit of heat with my heat gun just to make this a little bit more malleable in order to actually get it to stick down. And it's stuck really good now, so everything should be absolutely perfect. Very easy install, guys. You know, didn't take me longer than a few minutes to do this. Really, really nice, clean setup. You've got your wire that goes to uh, the electric goggles there. And then that's the one that's going to basically get plugged into the sled. So check this definitely out from Bite Harder. It's the Bite Harder Helmet Safety Light. I want to give a big shout out to uh, Craig Nicholson and the Intrepid Snowmobiler crew for introducing us to these. Um, again, I think you guys will see from the video work how bright these are. And uh, we'll show you guys a bit of demonstrations as well as to how this looks. All right, guys, so I just kind of set things up. I've um, got a little battery here that I should be able to show you exactly um, what this looks like when you've got it all wired up. So let's, uh, let's see. There you go. Look at how bright that is. I mean, it's crazy bright. All right, so just to give you a quick comparison, I mean, that's the light that you get on the BRP helmet. It's really great. I mean, it's integrated and it looks awesome. But just to give you a sense as to the difference in brightness, that's what you get with the BRP oxygen. So we definitely noticed, you know, with the, uh, the bite harder light, the LEDs are much, much brighter. And it's also a wider strip. So you can certainly see them um, a lot better in, again, both night riding as well as in snow dust. So definitely uh, check them out, guys. Bite Harder's Helmet Safety Light Kit. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed that video. We aren't done yet because uh, we want to hook you guys up with something as well. So we're going to partner up with Bite Harder uh, for this. And for those of you who are looking for one of these helmet safety light kits, uh, you can get your hands on one at a 30% discount. So what we're going to do is the first five folks that... Uh, send us, send Jesse and I an email to sledaddicts at gmail.com. We'll put the uh, email address at the bottom of this video. Do three things with that email. One, 
Just send us a photo from your phone that you liked uh, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, second thing, send us a, another pic that you are like to our Facebook page or our Instagram, uh, following our Instagram channel. And then the third thing is make sure you share this video out across your social media networks and tag us at Sled Addicts. And uh, you do those three things, send us that email. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna get the first five people that send that in. Uh, Jesse and I will reach out to you directly. We'll make sure we get you connected with Bite Harder and we'll hook you guys up with a 30% discount off of one of these kits. So you'll be all set for the 23 season. So thanks for watching guys. We appreciate you and uh, we'll see you on the next one. If you liked that video, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the Sled Addicts YouTube channel where we release content on everything snowmobiles. Also, hit that bell icon so you can be updated every time we release new videos.